Hello, I am back and today is a very quick explore so I'm going to get straight into it guys <laughs> Guys, this is a Cold War monitoring station and I'm going to take you down for a look at that right now so let's go Glad it's fairly solid to, to be honest uh, Just tighten this up again guys, bear with me Okay, so Let's go down and have a look. Right guys, so this place, if I can get over the water here, is a monitoring post. Oh jeez oh guys. Wow. I'm shocked the stuff's still in here. Some fuses. Little table, picture, receiver switch, receiver switch, filter unit. So, guys, I'm actually here with Tommy and uh, Dale Hunter once again. But just look at this place, guys. People were sleeping down here. It's the bunk beds. It's an upturned pail. Probably had sand in it at one time for fires or something, possibly. Wow, look at the old, uh, the old candlestick holder. That's like... Uh, that looks... That looks wartime. That looks authentic wartime now. Guys, there's somebody doing here. I'll just look at this place, guys. Some folding chairs. What an awesome place. Really cool we find. Oh. Pots and pans. A wee whistling kettle. Look at that. Jeez, oh. This is mad. That looks like uh, the bedding inside that. That bin liner. That is, there's more bedding there. Looks like that material that would uh, be really itchy. <laughs> But guys, unlike the horror movies, there's nothing under the bed. So it's not very big. Like I say, it's a small explore. But it's an interesting one nonetheless. So there you go. If you've never seen the inside of a monitoring station, here's your first look at one. Hey guys, just going to get back in here. <laughs> oh, that puts me mind of that form the hatch. <laughs> if you just grab that for a second. So guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed that. And uh, until next time, this is Pajerico. Signing off.